Uh, welcome back guys, so Real quick, real basic, I mean not really basic because you know people have issues with this People have questions about this, basic how to pretty much You know set, set your settings on the actual machine software So you know this is where you control what happens, your audio equipment and stuff, so this is the software so you log in, you go to uh, you go to file, go to file, go to preference. So the preference opens up. Right here, you can make your basic settings. So the most of these come default. So the, on the general tab, you have a startup it says to reload last project. It comes as a default. Recording audio, prefer project folder. You check that. Then the metronome enable the metronome. The you know the, in the stuff that counts you in, and the volume. Set your volume time signature. Very important. Very important. It comes default uh, a quarter of a time. One a quarter. You can set it to one eight one sixteen for those that understand time signature. You know it. It sets the timing of your of your beats. You know so depending on what kind of song you're making time signature is very important this is where you change it you change it this the actual song whatever song you have or whatever pattern you have on at that time it adopts to the new time signature then the counting bar the counting length is one bar by default you can change that to two bars or four bars you know one bar is cool you know but two bars give you a lot more time to to get your you know your beats together you can quantize none so you can do it by yourself so uh, you can quantize what you're recording or you quant you know quantize what you play and record this is where you set it all right and then the audio very important too the basic audio the general audio driver is always the ASIO this is where you select your device so mine is the focus right USB that's what you select you know you select your device so your device talks to to machine all right sample rate is where you set your sample rate a lot of people a lot of people do 96 96 is higher you know quality radio quality standard you know but you might get some from some lagging if you do that so you gotta have enough processing power to do that but 44 100 is uh, 48 100 is all good all right it is all good and then he said that it inputs, you know, machine left and right, in and out, outputs, all four, you know, in this probably these are all default. MIDI, I don't have um, MIDI that much, but if you do, this is where you select MIDI. So MIDI mode for now is off, because I don't, you know, we don't use MIDI that much these days use MIDI for connection but um, I solely depend on whatever goes into the actual software from the machine into you know naturally how that works these are all default stuff project standard template boom set project folder plugin wherever your plugins are I don't want to open anything um sound pattern length you can set the default libraries where you set you know this is factory where your file comes from you gotta come in here you can change and this is a library of where your um all your plugins are and your sound all your sounds that you bought from machine this is where it dumps it and this is this is for the plugins this is for the library for your you know for your sounds the drum live the laser the magna all that stuff we buy for 49 49.99 right <laughs> sometimes they got good sales this is your plugins in here you can change folders you can switch around you can you know on the uh, this is the hardware the pads the controller colors you can scene color you can change your scene colors to what you want what's comfortable for you the group colors change them to what's comfortable for you 
sound color so change it to what's comfortable for you you can select to load with colors i have mine to load with colors so that's that's pretty much it so it's under file preference file preference you got to play around with this if you're a new setup or you lose connection or something happens and you got to re redo something again or you buy a new audio equipment or you even buy a new um so a new um expansion you know all right so that's pretty much it and uh um, we'll see you guys bye you can like also like please like and subscribe to this and uh we'll bring you more as i start